Hello. Best wishes for a happy new year on behalf of all my colleagues here at the British Embassy and the British Consular Network across the Greek islands. We've got an exciting year ahead of us and we're all looking forward to it. This is my first video message for 2022 and I wanted to address it to you, fellow UK nationals living here in Greece. You make up a large community of, we reckon, some 45,000 people. Most of you have been here for many years and you've built your lives here. You have friends and family, long-standing connections and roots in the community. So I know that this feels like home to you. In fact, in many ways, Greece feels like home for me too, with my wife's family here. So I wanted at the beginning of the year to take this opportunity to express how important this community is for us. You, along with the fellow Greeks living in the United Kingdom, represent the bridge between our two countries. I know that many of you are very well embedded in your local communities, whether here in Athens and Attica or around the rest of this beautiful country, in the mainland or on the islands. And many of you may not need or want our help very often. But I also want you to know that we are here to help if you do need us by providing detailed and updated guidance on our Living in Greece guide on gov.uk and for anybody in need of additional support via our consular contact centres that are available 24 hours a day. You can find the details under the video. I think we would all agree that the last couple of years have been more than challenging for everybody. COVID-19 has been especially difficult. But I also hope we can find some comfort in the science and the remarkable steps that have been taken in developing vaccines and helping us tackle the pandemic here in Greece, in the United Kingdom and across the world. I'm also aware that there are some day-to-day -day administrative issues that some of you have encountered here when trying to get your vaccine or when trying to register that. I'm very glad to see that things are now sorted. I'm pleased to have my own vaccination certificate on the gov.gr app, even though I was first vaccinated in France and had my booster in London, but I'm now living in Greece. So I hope most of you, if not all of you, have now had the chance to get your vaccines and that you're staying safe and looking after yourselves and your loved ones. And of course, it's not just been the pandemic. This month, January 2022, marks 13 months since the United Kingdom left the European Union. That means for our bilateral relationship between Greece and the United Kingdom, we've got a new partnership to build and lots of work to do to put that in place. But we're doing so against a positive backdrop. This past year, we've been working closely and constructively with the Greek authorities to make sure that we deliver on both our government's commitment to protect citizens' rights, your rights, here in Greece. I know there were some hiccups earlier on, as is the case with all new systems. But I'm glad to say that I think we're in a good place now, with most issues resolved. But the key point is that our commitment remains the same to you for the new year as it did last year. We will continue to be ready to engage with you and the Greek authorities to find ways to help you if you need that help. Our embassy team is always working closely, often behind the scenes, with our Greek partners to highlight any challenges encountered by British nationals on all and any matters. And I'd like to take this opportunity to thank our Greek partners for that smooth collaboration and partnership. We've been working closely together all these years and I'm confident we will continue to do so over the months ahead. So before I finish up, let me just say We've got a lot to look forward to in 2022 and I'm optimistic about what we can achieve. As your ambassador, I look forward to meeting as many of you as I can, to coming to your communities, to getting to know you and to hearing from you about your thoughts and concerns, your ideas and suggestions. So please take a moment to share your comments with anything here you wish to raise. Or even better, please take a few minutes to complete our survey form and let us know how you think we can be more helpful. 
You'll find details about the survey under the video. I'd like to mark this four-month point since my arrival as a new beginning in our communication for the years to come. I'm looking forward to meeting as many of you as possible in person and I want to wish you all a very happy new year and a prosperous, happy and safe 2022. Thank you.